Let the truth be told, medical can't outrep Amrado. Nowadays, it seems like Charlie, you just can't drop an album and let your talent do the selling and as it do the talking. It seems that like if you have an album on the way, you gotta go to radio or TV interviews to talk trash so that people's eyes will be focused on you sell album neighbor in case you just came across this video and you haven't subscribed please do me a favor press the subscription button put me on notification so that whenever i drop a video you won't miss out write your opinion in the comment section don't forget to share let's go pmg medical has been doing some media tour for his upcoming album planning and plotting so he's jumping from radio stations to radio stations and from tv stations to tv stations Recently, he had an interview with Ghana TV3. Ever since he started doing this media tour, no, he's been dropping informations beer. To me, you know, these informations, no, they have nothing in, the, in this media space. These informations no, should have stayed between him and the person he has issues with. For example, the issue he has with his manager, Phil Delhi. He just dropped the information himself. He sacked him. He's not working with him no more. To me, I don't really believe he has issues with Flodeli. It looks like it's a strategy for him to be talked about or for his album to be talked about. But let's put this shit aside. But what really doesn't make sense to me, you know, I've been thinking about it ever since I came across it, you know, is this issue I'm coming to talk about. If we recall Amrado, this medical on a track called Medicated Soap, this this track no, dropped or was dropped or was released three or two years ago to so this day medical hasn't replied even we the listeners crown have forgotten amrado once this medical on a track called medicated soap i have even forgotten these two had issues back in the days during his media tour no, he went and grant an interview at Ghana TV3 and during this interview, you know, he was asked whether he is cool with Amrado. He said, no, but I have nothing against him and he isn't my friend, blah, blah, blah. Check the video and let's continue. How are you and Amrado? Are you guys friends? Are you guys cool? Um, we are not friends. I don't have anything against him. But I think a few years ago, he dissed me. He did a diss track for me. I didn't do anything to that lad. You, you know? didn't reply? No, I, don't, I didn't do that. Why? Why I didn't reply? Yeah, yeah because most artists would reply. I'm, Ideally, in, in Then I feel way. like you don't reach my level to for me to... Oh, you didn't downgrade them? No, that's not... I'm being, like, Real. I'm being honest. Like, mm. me, I'll be honest. Any question you ask me, I will answer you, like... So, you know, but oh. now it reached your level. Oh, how? Still, I'm not going to reach your level. That's why you didn't respond to him, because he's not at your level. Yeah. So, who did your level? <laughs> if you go to... No, first of all, what, what level are you on? <laughs> exactly. Where are they level 400? Of, where, level 400, level 400. So what does it entail? Honestly, <laughs> if you have to describe the work you've put into your craft no, I'm and saying, the level you're on. I'm saying at that point, the point where he, he, he did the, the diss track, like, uh, I, I feel like I don't respond because he no reach where I feel safe for reach for me to for him to get my attention to. So why you think say for what? reach like if for reach like in terms of music or money or status like say how? Oh, in life you see sometimes there are certain things that I see online or people talking about me and then you know people not say medical they they talk in mind if you do something you also this you tweet something or like record a diss track but. I'm not up for that when you know go bring anything we go be you know we go help me or we go make I make money or you know something like that. Huh? Complete the Someone complete who the help statement. you to make money. It has to be something we I go also benefit from. Mm. And at that point you didn't think that there was going to be any benefit from nah. at all. You, at you didn't all. think so. Maybe. Mm -hmm. So the this track Amrado released for medical two or three years ago. No? It seems like this this track no. Hit this guy to the scar to the extent, say he couldn't sleep. Just say within these three years, no, he hasn't really slept well. Because how can this issue that been like we all thought say it has been buried in the past, no, be a current issue again? When asked whether he replied the diss track Amrado did for him, now nah, he is saying he didn't reply Amrado because Amrado is not his level. Jesse, or part Jesse, his level higher than Amrado's. Like, bro, in this beef shit, no, I'm talking about rap shit, no. 
There is nothing like uh, you are not my level, bro. If Patapa mentions your name on a track or in a song that really you are, no matter how high your level is, you gotta respond. Like which level is medical talking about? Is he talking about the pool level and I say the level of his mansion and I say, Charlie, I want to understand. Because from the look of things, bro, let the truth be told. Medical can't out rep Amrado. No matter how high your level is, a band rapper, bro. Medical cannot. This isn't even for debate. If you are scared, actually, just admit. There is nothing bad about a man, a standing man, telling the truth, say, bro, this guy really raps good. Or rap it. In that choice, one shall never go back to bar. One shall then be shut from. Bro, in this rap shit, you know, we be our own master. So I call the crowd about rap shit anymore. I'm not talking about only in Ghana. Across the world, I uh, also want a master. You feel me? So don't be like he's not my level. He's not my level. This statement is not an excuse. This statement confirms, say, bro, you were scared. But you were scared, and so no, this shit been sitting on your heart for three fucking years. Even after two to three years, crano, you been talking about it, or you still talking about it? Like, sir, what the crano? If someone under his level downgrade him, man, maybe he he might not give you like a full diss track, like he gave to Shatawala and Asa Manifest. He might give you some line B or on a track actually. Obe chiku small. He will come tell you say you are not his level unless he don't wanna reply you. Then he will even drop this statement. So won't get me level. Okay, just say say I didn't want to reply him. You feel me? Because you say say he's not your level. It doesn't justify the shit. Say you could have beaten him on a track. Oh God no. Everybody knows it. You know it. Everyone knows it. Say you can't outrep Amrado. This guy is a beast. And I know, say this statement you don't drop during your interview. No? Amrado won't let it slide. And Kemikra won't let it slide. I will just give you a bar for you to promote your planning and plotting. Because sometimes I ask myself, say if these rappers go to interview, sir, are some of these questions planned? Do some of the people tell the presenters which questions to ask? Because I can't come to your radio station trying to promote my tracker. You asking me questions about another man I don't even fuck with no more. And I say, hey, what Let's see which statement Medica will be dropping whilst doing this media tour. Because you see, idea, he done dropped a couple of informations which should have been kept away from this media space. Wakasa for Debbie, they did a track together. He talked about Debbie, he done talked about Flo Deli. His manager, he been with like, like, bro, before he even blew. This shit should have stayed between you both. And full be out. Girls do that, not men. And as I said, they are about mad or so. So he's doing anything or everything just to promote the planning and plotting. Hey, just let your talent talk. Sir Kodia would never drop Sadiwi unless it is necessary. Bro, it's not that necessary. Go by the name Pine Girl. I'm out.